Hi booktube! I'm here with another video in my No Shame series. And this time I want to talk about unfinished books. Let me just tell you, life is too short for bad books. I think that the number one cause of reading slumps, in my opinion and in my experience, is a bad book. You know, sometimes you can tell right away that a book's not for you. Um, and that's not going to work for you. Maybe the writing's off, the characters are flat, or maybe the the book feels like it's been resolved before it ends. I know I've had that experience a few times. Um, I don't think we should feel bad for, for setting it down at that point. Um, what's the point of doing something you don't enjoy? Um, there are a myriad of, of other books out there that you can read instead. I mean, Leaving things unfinished may go against your nature, but if you're not enjoying something, if you're not learning from it, um, if you're not getting anything out but that sense of an ending, then unless you have some form of time travel, you're not going to get that time back. I think if you must finish a book, I don't think you should feel bad about skim reading it, maybe skipping to the end and seeing if it is worth finishing. It's not the reader's job to find something to enjoy in the book. It's the writer's job to write a good book, and you shouldn't feel bad about not liking something that someone has failed to do for you. So, in your opinion, whose responsibility is the enjoyment of a book? The reader or the writer? Let's get a discussion going, and remember to put the book down if you don't enjoy reading it.